Alright, so this is probably going to be the finale of Portrait of Ruin. And if it isn't, I'm gonna be pretty surprised. <laughs> so, yeah. We're playing more of this game, obviously. And, you know, I'm having a lot of fun with it, obviously. Because, um, I just love using- I just love spamming magic. <laughs> There's something really fun about doing that. I love how I have this tradition of just coming up with funny ways to say Castlevania and, like, the title of the game. So it just becomes, like, Apartmentvania and then some funny words that are just synonyms to other words. So, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, we have to go into the last painting before we fight Brawner. It's a really stupid name, Brawner. <laughs> Frickin' Brawner. Sounds like, um... I don't know, it sounds like a food. It sounds like a food you'd find in, like, a European country or something. It's like, hey, hey, hey you wanna come over to my place for some Brawna? <laughs> 13th Street. <laughs> no plagiarism intended. Definitely not based on, um, Friday the 13th. What the fuck? What the hell? <laughs> well, that, that, that train just kind of came out of nowhere, didn't it? Man, he just comes out way too late. <laughs> Clearly I'm supposed to be able to stop the train. Bro, are you fucking serious? I almost had that shit. Go on, stop the train. Thank God. <laughs> okay. That was a silly way to start out this level. Yeah, if I did that last night, I would have been like tearing my hair out because I was like ready to go to bed, but now it's a new day. Yeah, watch out for the freaking missiles. Anyways, I have, uh, some good news, everyone. So last night, I installed Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon on my Switch. And, uh, because, for you who you don't know, that's gonna be the next game I play after I beat this game. I'm gonna be playing Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon after. I mean, it's, it's basically a tradition at this point that I play, you know... Luigi's Mansion and Castlevania, like, pretty much back-to-back. -back. Well, I think I actually, I don't know. I don't think I did Luigi's Mansion last year. I could be wrong. I think I took a, t I think I took a year off of Luigi's Mansion. But I know I've played all of the games on the channel now. I've played 1 and 3. And I'm going to be playing Dark Moon. Which, um... I don't care. I refuse to call. I refuse to call it the Luigi's Mansion 2. Dark Moon just sounds way cooler. Even though I know it doesn't make much sense to go one Dark Moon and then three. But still, my point stands. <laughs> nice skybox we got here. Assassin's Cape. Um. Hmm. A stealthy cape favored by assassins. Lowers my mind by 10, though. That might be for that might be for Jonathan then. Yeah. Let's give that to him. He still has the holy mantle. <laughs> I'm guessing the blue cape is 
Actually, no, the blue cape's pretty decent. I mean, it lowers my my mind by 10, though. But more intelligence might be nice. Eh, whatever, I'll, I'll try it. Yep. Alright. Man, there's so many of these enemies, bro. Yeah, just nuke, screen nuke. And I still, I still died. Well, I still got hit, rather. Oh, yeah, all right, I have Tempest equipped still. Freaking rippers, man. Definitely not, um... Definitely not, um... Fleet men. Oh, wait, the these guys, these are basically red skeletons, but as armor. They can way too much damage here. Hey, at least I'm able to push this, you know, by myself. I mean... I don't know what the point of that even is. I don't even know why that was there, to be honest. I don't even really. Oh, what the hell? I don't even really need to use my super attacks unless it's an enemy that I like really hate. But no, the Fleeman don't count. They're 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 a little too easy to take down. Oh. Yo, we got Nyx. It's just a... It's just a lady with a frickin' needle. It's Kampa. It's Kampa in Castlevania form. Okay, well, no reason going after these guys. Because they don't die. So many, so many freaking armor enemies. Oh yeah, I have that curry. Let's see. Oh my god, the curry is a full heal. <laughs> Thing is, you, you don't, you can't really tell like with these items. You can't tell if they're gonna be like amazing or if they're gonna be like mediocre. Oh shit! Oh shit! I'm cursed. The good thing the curse potion affects everybody. What the hell is this thing? Oh, I'm poisoned. I don't have any anti venom. I'm supposed to be using my uh I'm supposed to be using my uncurse uh or my anti venom thing. Uh Gato Moron. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> well, that was a waste. Ooh, safe point. I think this is the only time I've done a uh, Castlevania stream in the morning this year. <laughs> Maybe I should put my uh maybe I should put my thermos over here. So that way I don't have to freaking crouch down every time I want to grab it. <laughs> yeah, I installed Dark Moon last night and uh it went well. I, I have it now and I'm ready to play it on my Switch. I booted up the game and make sure it works. And um I mean it lo looks like it works just fine. So no problems I think. I mean, I guess we'll find out if anything breaks when I boot it up, you know, next... I think probably next week I'll start it. Just gonna completely finish up this game this week. <laughs> so, hey, that's pretty good.
We got a whole bunch of funny enemies. Actually, let's do this. Screen nuke. And just ignore those guys. Aliorumnas. Or how you say that name? Skeleton Blaze. Yes, he man, it's me, the skeleton. Well, as you can tell, Desmond was not in the mood to play last night. He just said he wasn't. He just wasn't feeling well or something. Samurai leggings. Those are technically better. Very cool. Look how strong I am. I'm gonna increase my strength some more. Man, at this rate, Jonathan is stronger than Scarlet is. Oh, uh, we got some funny dancers in this room. Woo! I'm not even gonna bother trying to pronounce that. <laughs> And tea! Huh. Well, speaking of tea, look what I'm drinking right now. Yeah. Ichi's trying to attack the dancer. <laughs> that guy can't even- that guy can't even attack me. Thirty-six. Look, that actually- that actually did something. Yeah, those final guards are pretty rough. Ooh, I appreciate the HP up, though. He took 36 from a meteor, so he does have defense. Mm, I don't actually know which way to go correct way here. Yeah, you hear funny skeleton. I want to see what's up here, if there's anything. Too many dancers. I don't even know if there is anything up here. Oh, wait, there is. Okay. <laughs> it's like a room to use my screen nuke on. Yeah, let me, let me just, let me just wait up. I'm just gonna actually wait. What am I doing? Um, uh, use a tonic. Screen nuke. <laughs> Wedding dress. Oh fuck! They poisoned me. I didn't know these guys could poison me. Well, I need, I need a toad morph to even get out of here, so... Drink some tea. Oh, wait, tea heals MP. Oh, interesting. <laughs> you don't want to stay as a toad, though. Being a toad is, is actually, like, shit. <laughs> Ballroom mask. Look at all these sick- look at all these sick accessories I've got. I'm gonna save. Um... Princess coat and wedding dress. Um... Hard to say. 
I mean, look at that strength, though. I think it's worth it. I mean, yeah, I get three of the, the bottom stats, but Wedding Dress seems way better. Oh, boss already. Okay, so that definitely means I missed something then. I'm gonna go everywhere but the boss room. Teleport. Oh, I, I'm freaking poisoned again, dude. Every time, man. They just love spamming um, poison in the second half of the game. Well... Did I not I Did I not just save, like, not too long ago? And now I'm already healing? Yeah, here you dumb dancers. Alright, I appreciate the MP. Oh my god, there's a lot of enemies. <laughs> the amount of enemies on screen is crazy. Ah, oh, I just spawned in and he immediately killed a ghost dancer. <laughs> Meteor of this guy. Demon. It's like a greater demon or something. Thankfully, I don't have to grind those guys. Because if that's one thing I can say I don't like about Dawn of Sorrow, it's all the grinding you have to do. You have to 100%, if you want 100% the game. Well. Cause like, um, you have to like, cause the, the soul drops are random chance, obviously. And that's not fun. So many dancers. There's so many ghouls on screen. Gabba ghoul. Can I just kill this guy from down here? <laughs> Mothman. Oh yeah, my 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 T isn't down there. I keep forgetting. <laughs> Okay, let's go back then. I think it's faster to go back this way. I mean, how am I supposed to know which way is the correct way? Okay, this is there's nothing here. There's a cross. That's it? Uh, there's a cross? Uh, those are probably gonna be important somehow. I don't know how yet, though. But I guess we'll go save. We're already at the boss. That didn't take very long at all, did it? it took 20 minutes. I mean, this map looks very incomplete. 
I feel like I'm totally missing something here. We got a werewolf. Definitely is some potions. Is he dead already? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm too OP now. <laughs> yeah, these bosses have been complete pushovers. Alright, so what could we possibly get for all that? Nothing. You don't get jack shit for that. Is this map really completed already? It says I have 860%. Well, if Bronner's painting is its own world that I have to complete. Do you have anything to say? I think we should probably go back to Wind and see what he has to say. Yeah. I mean, the, this map looks pretty complete to me. I can't really see anywhere else that I haven't been yet. I feel like there's not a lot of, like unique areas that you can go to. Like, I don't feel like... Okay, I think my biggest problem with this game is there's not really any backtracking. Which is, like, the whole point of a Metroidvania. Like, you barely have to do any backtracking. And also, all the map... The, the, the entire map just feels really disjointed from itself. You're back. Oh. I thought I would have something to say now that I beat the last painting. Okay, I guess not. We can buy some potions, some tonics. I, I guess I'll buy anti venom for convenience sake. And you know, sure, powdered milk. Is there anything worth selling at this point? I mean, I can sell the castle maps now. I mean, why not, right? Oh yeah, I probably don't need the gold plate anymore. Berserker mail is good. Sell the platinum corset. Sell the Europa dress. Um. Nah, Princess Code's worse. Ballroom mask. Oh yeah, I never wore that. Oh, that's for him. It's kind of looks kind of shit. Attica helmet. Royal. Sa I'm still wearing the royal sandals. That's kind of funny. Um, yeah, the Steel Greaves are not good. Blue Cape isn't worth it anymore. Thank you. Yeah, our, 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 uh... Oh, I, I sold something by accident. Oh, well. <laughs> I think I just, I think I sold the thing that I was wearing. You shouldn't be able to do that, though. They shouldn't allow you to, um, like, sell the shit you're wearing. That's really confusing. Oh well, guess I'm wearing the charm necklace again. That was short-lived. Oof. What's the stanky leg? Okay. Well, I'm kind of hot, so I'm going to uh, go take a quick break, but uh, I'll be right back. All right, that feels a lot better. Might not make much, might might not seem like a big difference, but uh, soaking my shirt a little bit actually does cool me off a lot. So oh, that's good. Anyways, I have like full items, so I guess we're gonna go fight Brawner. It's just, it's just Palpatine, bro. You can't convince me otherwise. 
somehow Palpatine returned. <laughs> Is there no way to check, like, how much percentage in each area you have? Because if that- if it doesn't tell you that, that mu that makes it really annoying. View map percentage. Oh. Okay, it says 92%. 93%. Oh yeah, you know what? I could go back there. Hmm. What could I be missing? Oh, Forgotten City is 100%. Sandy Grave is 97. I think I'm missing like one square, or like a few squares there. Nation of Fools, done. Burnt Paradise is done. Forest of Doom, I apparently didn't beat. I don't know what I was missing there. Dark Academy is more complete. Dracula's Castle itself is 92. Hmm. You know what? Since it's gonna bother me, why don't we go back to the first world? And go clear out that part of the map that I never did. Why is Fat Guy streaming Paper Mario Black Pit all these years later? Like, didn't he beat that game already? <laughs> Apparently he's like trying to 100% it or something. But you know what, I guess it's kind of a noble thing. Okay, but yeah, according to my map, there is um, an area that I can access now. And it would bother me if I didn't at least have a look. Slinger. I love, I love how Charlie just keeps screaming like, No! Even though she only takes like one damage. <laughs> it's like, girl, calm down. It's one damage. You'll be fine. Can't help but feel like that looks kind of sus. Oh yeah, this freaking room. So what was stopping me from coming up here? Oh yeah. I didn't have um, the frog ability at the time. Okay, that's really rude. Milliken sword. Now it says 93%. What the fuck am I- what the hell could I be missing? I literally came back for a sword that probably isn't even good at this point. T yeah. Okay, so it turns out there wasn't actually that much here. Mini Devil. Yeah, it turns out I didn't come back here for all that much. Just a dinky sword that I'm never going to use. Because, I mean, who in their right mind would want to come back to this place, all the, go all the way there and get that little sword? It, it's probably for, like, 100% purposes or something. <laughs> One damage. Yeah, the music is definitely growing on me, though. Which is good, you know. I wanna- I wanna listen to some of this, this music later. Okay, well, we're basically done, so I think I'm ready to go do that last painting. Actually, out of curiosity, I wonder if it'll let me, um... I wonder if it'll let me go and fight Bronner, like, without going into his painting. Well, because apparently there's two different endings, depending on if you kill Brawner or not, or something like that. I don't know how true that is. I kind of want to have a look at the, um... I kind of want to have a look at the, um... That, that force field or whatever. And see if I still can't get in there. Nope. 
I think, I think I have to do this painting then. There's gonna be chilling here for the rest of the game, probably. Alright, big painting time. Stella, Loretta, I told you not to come here. Hey, hey, who are you talking to? They're busy following orders. You, you two, what have you done to my daughters? Sadly for you, they've regained their senses. Thanks to my magic. How can this be? How could you two understand? Those two are the reincarnations of my dead daughters. I don't care. Being a family means being connected by heart. Ties of blood and souls are insignificant. When I learned why my father did what he did, I understood. You used a curse to manipulate your dear daughters. Now that's sad. And now I must suffer the loss of my daughters to humanity again. I'll show you how that feels. And then I'll make those girls my daughters once more. Now that's a problem. Sorry, can't let you do that. Behold the power of my painting. Alright, um... If I had to guess, he's probably weak to light, right? <laughs> Yep. Ow. <laughs> what is what is Ro doing? Drink the powder milk. Also, I'm out of I'm out of uh. He's still he's still poison, bro. What the hell? I'm just getting knocked back and forth. Oh. Shit. Man, he drains your- he drains your magic really fucking fast. Oh, am I supposed to get rid of all this? Oh, you know what? Did I get rid of it with the touchscreen? Oh, no, I can't. That's bad news. Spirit of no! <laughs> am, I still, am I supposed to have him in his painting? I don't know how you're supposed to dodge that, to be honest. <laughs> but we're gonna cover all my stuff. <laughs> I just keep getting knocked around, bro. You know what, Meteor? 317, damn. Got him. Damn you humans. You selfishly start wars and despoil the earth. Perhaps justice wasn't on my side, but I'll never admit that it was on yours. Fine either way. After all, justice is just a matter of perspective. The fact is, you're just a coward who couldn't face the truth. You couldn't accept your fate, so you just abandoned humanity to get what you wanted. I just... I just wanted to protect my family. Damn. Ha 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 ha. Well done. Now the interloper is no more. What? The studio painting was cutting off the throne needed to revive Lord Dracula. 
A clever plan. Alas, now my lord can be revived. Ha 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 ha! Was I supposed to do that? I sense terribly powerful magic up ahead. Meaning Dracula's that way. Restoring the castle's power? Without a doubt, this is what death was after. Yeah, I, I want to make sure I didn't do anything wrong. Portrait of Ruin Endings. Um, let's see. Let's see, um... The Vincent endings. <laughs> um let's see. Uh Well, I mean obviously I didn't execute the twins. Um Hmm. The Vincent endings, that's one thing. Hmm. Okay, so apparently there are only two endings. It's just the, uh, the bad ending, which doesn't mean much, and then there's the good ending. So there's not really a tr there's not really a best ending, it looks like. Without a doubt, this is what death was after. Come on, we can't just sit around and let this happen. Let's go, Charlotte. Hold it. Our enemy is a legendary monster. This won't be easy. You're right. Maybe we should check our supplies first. <laughs> the throne room. Oh, well, apparently um, we can go here now. Okay, well, let's look. I mean, Spirit of Light's okay, but it, it's kind of hard to use. Just because of the fact that it, um... Well, what am I trying to say? Just because of the fact that, um... I don't even remember what the fuck I'm trying to say. <laughs> well, like, it, it goes at a weird, like, angle, and it doesn't hit half the time. That's why I don't really like it too much. Something like Tempest is way more accurate. Because, um... It, like, stays in one spot and hits the enemy constantly. Why does it say there's something below here? Oh, look at this. There's a free super potion here. Or no, a HP up. I wonder if, um, Castle Percentage also takes into consideration the items you found. There we go. Yeah, apparently, apparently we're going to the throne room. Oh, MP Max. Oh, and Moon Knee. In case you need extra Moon Knee, there you go. I guess I'll make a save state because I'm too lazy to go back and actually save properly. Dracula. I can't believe this power. No wonder he's called the Lord of Darkness. That is a weird looking Dracula. <laughs> oh, so you're ignoring me? Turn to face me. You will not touch Lord Dracula. This time, let's fight for real. Oh, we get to fight death again? Enough with this side show. Why don't we show him our combined power? A death and Dracula joint attack? That was never mentioned in any book I've read. Well, there's two of us, so I guess that makes it even. No problem, bring it on. So we have to fight Dracula and death at the same time? Damn, okay. And I'm getting my ass kicked already. <laughs> A 
I'll probably, maybe I should focus on killing death first then. Well, if I can stop getting my ass kicked. Why'd I use the super tonic? Oh my god, I'm actually getting wrecked here. What the hell? <laughs> Yeah, maybe, t maybe Tempt is not the wisest move here. Uh, let's heal. Tempest might not be the best place for this fight, honestly. <laughs> I am almost out of heals. Hmm. What well, what else could I use? I could use all boost, maybe. I'm out of uh, I'm out of MP again. I'm running out of potions. <laughs> I could use Dark Rift if that helps. Because it does absorb projectiles. Well, some of them, anyway. I'm actually using up all my, uh, all my potions. Yeah, see how that doesn't do anything? What the fuck was that? What the fuck happened there? I died instantly, bro. Alright, oh, I have a safe state. <laughs> and having to dodge two different attacks at once is kind of rough. Try Spirit of Light again. I was supposed to kill Dracula first, I don't know. Jesus, man, I'm getting knocked around so much. That, that straight up killed me, what the fuck? <laughs> did I even put on the right thing? No, I did not.
Hmm. I might solo this fight, honestly, because Jonathan can only help so much. And he's gonna be draining my MP like crazy. Bro. Dude, when he does the bad attack, it just instantly kills me. So you do not want to get hit by that. Hmm. Is there anything I'd want to have on Jonathan? Maybe, um... Maybe the knee strike. I don't know. This Dracula fight might actually be a challenge. Cause I basically have max I basically have max potions. Gotta watch out for the bat attack. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, you don't want to get hit by that. Definitely heal up. Yeah, let's do the let's do the meteor. And I'm almost dead again. <laughs> Fuck, dude. They have like their own like team up attacks. Damn, bro. This is like the first this is the first time Dracula's really been that challenging since like um Circle of the Moon. <laughs> okay, yeah, you don't want to be near that. That that's an insta kill basically. Spirit of no. Um, I'm running out of potions actually. Oh, well, death is dead. Oh shit, Dracula is getting stronger.
Okay. Oh, I have. I, th I think I have to kill with the vampire killer. Well, actually, I mean, I don't have to, but it would probably be better if I did. It, does, it, it would be a fitting end, I think. Oh, I forgot I still have freaking holy lightning on them. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> okay. So, if I can, um... Okay, so I got an idea then for this. So, I think I think a great way to end off the game... <clears throat> ...would be to... ...would be to do Phase 1 as Charlotte, and then do Phase 2 as Jonathan. And then we can end the game off on, like, a really good note. <laughs> He's gotta not get, like, stuck in the corner. So I think, ideally, you probably just want to go for death, then. Oh yeah, get, get away from that. It's going much better than the last attempt. Okay, never mind. Wing comboed. Oh yeah, I don't want to get comboed by that. Also, I'm almost dead. <laughs> I don't have any, like, super potions, I realized. I'm glad the I'm glad the De Dracula fight is challenging though. Jesus Christ! Stop getting stuck in the corner. You get iframes while this is happening, so... Alright, need some potions, some powdered milk, and, uh, high tonic. I, I didn't die from that this time. Yeah, real, real fair.
Oh yeah. Bro, I, I didn't have enough fucking mana to do the big attack. I mean, at least, hey, at least Spirit of Light goes in multiple directions. <laughs> Damn it. Okay. That's phase one. All right. Well, how many how many potions do I have left? Well, let's do meteor. Do meteor. Um. Well, we definitely have more potions than last time. That's for sure. How the hell is bro doing? But at least, uh, at least she can tank some stuff. I don't know what he's doing, but I don't like it. That looks like bad news. I am almost out of heals. Shit, we need a, we need a high tonic. Wait, actually, here, we can have- let's have Charlotte use, um, the all boost. Oh shit. That looks like bad news. What? <laughs> what the fuck? What are you supposed to do there? Damn. That- what a wild final phase. He bro- bro fucking just crushed me, dude. I don't know what I was supposed to do there, but okay. Hmm. Okay. Now I should be ready. Well, he can only shoot the fire in front of him. Which is, you know, a deliberate limitation for him. Dang. <laughs> Let's, get, let's use all the power of milk, like, early on. Oh my god, I'm getting comboed. I hate when this happens, bro.
Dang. Bro spawned on top of me. <laughs> I think you need to like go on the opposite side of him to dodge that shit. Yeah. I, I took way too much damage there. Yeah, you want to be on the opposite side of Dracula when he spawns in. Okay, well, if he's doing that attack, he's clearly almost dead. I think this is going better than last time, right? How many, how many potions do I have left? We got seven high potions. That should be decent, right? Oh yeah, right, I was gonna have, uh, Charlotte do, um... I mean, I could just have her do Spirit of Light, or I could have her buff my... buff all my stats. Having Charlotte is not really a good idea. Just just have her for bucks at this point. Maybe do the meteor. There. Okay, you have to damage it enough. These are my last potions, so... Uh, I got some tonics left. Come on. Well, that was a waste. Oh, fuck. Damn it, I died, bro. I can do that, though. We're, we're getting closer to beating him.
Bad start. Bad start of this fight, bro. Bro, I was just fucking reload at that point. What the fuck are you doing? This fight, this, this, this attempt is going pretty badly. Oops. Well, I fucked up. That was a, that was an easy fuck up right there. The hell? Never seen him do that before. Seems like he only does that like once per fight. Let's use a uh, super tonic. Full heal. Okay, I figured out how to dodge that, kind of. Alright, these are normal potions. Okay. He didn't even use his he didn't even use his big attack. Alright, how are we doing on potions? We have all nine high potions. And we got a few regular potions left too. Where's all boost? Love how he does like a stupid little kick, he's like, ah. Yeah, 
There we go. Why am I eating shit now? I just do a high tonic now. And you know what? Use a high potion. Doing it again? Is this actually damaging him at all? I don't know. <laughs> I got him! I think. Ooh. Too bad, pal. As long as we're here, you won't be revived. Still, that was an impressive display of impromptu teamwork. Say what you will. But I can see it. One day, my power will be fully revived. Fully or not, you're never ever gonna win. I look forward to seeing who will have the last laugh. That was a really good Dracula fight. Honestly, that and the Circle of the Moon Dracula fight are probably the, some of the best in the series. Oh, we got our ending with the sisters. It's all over. Yeah. We sure caused a lot of trouble. How can we make up for it? As the older sister, I accept full responsibility. With that, I must ask a favor of you two. No, you can't take all the blame. Loretta, be silent, please. Look, it's all settled now. If we keep quiet, there's no problem, right? <laughs> no problem. I, I suppose... I can't allow that. Well done, both of you. Eric. Well, I did make a promise. Father, is it truly you? Yes, my dear. Forgive me. Stella, you seem to have worried the most in all this. No, Father. It's an older sister's duty to... Yes, but still... Don't overdo your role, okay? I'm truly glad I could see you both at the moment of my death. Live for all you're worth. And you, Jonathan, Charlotte, I truly am grateful. Father! Don't go! Father! He passed on. Thank you, Eric, for everything. <laughs> yes, thank you, Eric, for your shitty side quests that I didn't get to finish. Stella, forgive me. You tried so hard for my sake. I'm going to become stronger. I'll try hard so that you'll never have to worry again. You need not always work so hard. That's right. Eric said himself, didn't he? Whatever you do, don't overdo it. Jonathan, for you, trying harder might be a good thing. <laughs> sure, no problem. Why can't you learn to just let things be? I mean, kid like you. <laughs> Excuse me, you two. Forgive me, all of you. I can see I've caused you a lot of worry, but I'm alright now. 
<laughs> Jonathan's freaking smug ass face. Oh no, I forgot. What? About Vincent. Uh oh. Quick, we gotta find him. Charlotte. Right. Loira, let's help them. Yes, Stella. Yeah, pretty good ending. Huh? Wait a second. Hey, I'm over here. Yay! We actually beat the game properly. <laughs> Yay! Wow, I mean... Honestly? I didn't really see any... I, I mean, like... Besides, like, a few really dumb puzzles, I guess... I didn't really... I, I loved this game. This was, this was really good. Curry the Kid... <laughs> Great name. Curry the Kid. Yude Egg. <laughs> Some great names we got here. I love the I love the team up mechanic. Like I don't I don't know if there's any other Castlevania game. Well, I guess no. Castlevania three technically did that. So it's kind of like that actually. It's kind of following what that game did, which is pretty neat. And I mean, yeah, I didn't really play Jonathan that much because you know I'm kind of sick of you know the typical whip hunter. Uh, like character archetype also um the screens are reversed i think <laughs> yeah i can tell i can tell i i cocked up because uh the characters are going in like reverse order <laughs> So yeah, I had a lot of fun playing the game mostly as Charlotte. It actually made the game pretty challenging because she doesn't have as much defense compared to Jonathan. So she, um, you know, she she eats shit a lot more, to say the least. And that that actually gave the game a pretty good challenge, I'd say. Especially that last Dracula fight, like dead ass. That was the that's probably the second hardest Dracula fight I've had to do because. In my opinion, I still think the Circle of the Moon Dracula is the hardest one. That one's- that's the hardest Dracula fight in the series, in my opinion. <laughs> but that one honestly comes a close second. Well, if we're talking just like final bosses in general, yeah. Because I- I think, um... Hmm. I mean, the Dawn of Sorrow one was pretty tricky, and I don't remember the Harmony of Dissonance one, honestly. And I pretty I forget the Arya Sorrow one, but that one must have been pretty easy because it doesn't stand out. The reason why the Circle of the Moon final boss stands out in my head so much is because of how fucking hard it was. So yeah, but yeah, that's a that's another Castlevania game under my belt for this year. Obviously, next year I'm going to be playing uh, Order of Ecclesia, which is the uh, last. DS Castlevania game. It's the last uh, Metroidvania game too, I think. I mean, unless Lords of Shadow counts. I mean, you, those are like the last two Castlevania games ever released. And then, you know, I mean, I don't think I'm gonna play Lords of Shadow for a while. Those are probably like, if anything, those are probably like some of the last ones I play. <laughs> Pac-Man! <laughs> Smug Pac-Man, that, that caught me off guard. That, that, that's hilarious. Okay, but apparently... Also, what the hell is co-op mode? Oh, shit. You can play this game co-op. Dude, that's awesome. I didn't know you could do that. Um... So, how do I... Apparently, if you beat the game, you unlock the ability to play as Richter. Um, let me see. Portrait of Ruin, Rick, Richter mode? How do you unlock Richter mode? I might, I might give, I might try it out a little bit. 
Um, yeah, it's not it's in a few Castlevania games. It's in Symphony and it's in Portrait of Ruin. Um, let's see. How do you how do you unlock it or how do you like select it? Is what I'm wondering. I'm not too sure. Where is where is Richter mode? Um, it says after beating the game. No, that that's no, that's for that's for uh, Symphony. I think. Hmm. Yeah, it says after being the game with Alucard and with Richter. What about, what about, what about Portrait of Ruin, though? Do I just have to select a new save file? Oh. Oh, you can also use the sisters, too. Let's try, let's try Richter mode. Since I have a bit of time, let's try it out. I don't usually try it out, but we can we can mess around since we have it. Richt? What the fuck? Wrecker. Um... Do I have to draw an emblem? We'll draw a goofy-ass smile. Okay, so here's, here's Richter mode. When he starts out with, um... Dude, look at this shit. Also, you can, uh, use whatever holy weapon you want. Yeah, let's just, let's just play, let's just play Richter mode for a little while. Also, does Richter have, um... Like, secret button combinations? I did like the little dash. Yeah, I don't know how you do that dash, but it's a thing you can do. Dude, I think the, I think the thing about uh, this already that I love is you can just go you go so fucking fast. Oh no! Whatever will I do? I can just jump over this. <laughs> yeah, one of these days I should probably, um... One of these days I probably should play, like, the Richter mode in some of these games. Oh wait, hang on a sec. Richter can just go wherever the hell he wants. So what what is even the goal of Richter mode? Well the thing the thing about Richter mode is um He takes a lot of damage. I'm probably not supposed to fight this guy right now, anyway. Yeah. Well, let's see if we can beat this guy anyway. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Wait, Richter levels up? Oh yeah, he does. Yeah! Honestly, this game is so fun that I would love to do a Rector playthrough someday. <laughs> Rector does his little pose. <laughs> He's gonna do, like, the, the farewell. I don't think he does that. That's pretty cool, though. 
Yeah, since this is such a short stream, I might actually just, you know, play as Rector for a while. Just because of how fun it is. So here's the thing, right? Also, what is that? What is- oh, that's Grand Cross, I think. I mean, why would I use anything but the whip? Or the- the cross, I mean. Um... The thing is... Is the game doesn't teach you... I feel like I'm- I'm supposed to be able to do something here. Um... Wait, doesn't he have, like, a way to go upwards? Richter gameplay, maybe? Bro, why is someone- why fucking- why all the fucking lag? <laughs> Bro, has been pretty laggy recently. Hmm. Oh yeah, that's right. You can call in- you can call in Maria, too. Which is really cool. Although she's, uh... She's not that fast. Yeah, she can summon in her, like... Animal friends. I know there's a way... I know there's a way to jump really high, but I don't remember what you do. Um... Maybe I need to look up his controls. Let's see... A special attack, some of you what I'm looking for. Um... The high jump. It's up an L. Oh! Yeah, I was- I was- That's the move I wanted to do. So the great thing is, Rector can literally just go anywhere he wants. Like, you really- you really feel like a boss while playing Richter. Alright, teleport. Oh, wait, hang on, this is the, um... This is the main hub. But there's nothing- there's no shop, obviously, in Richter mode. That's the thing about Richter mode, is you have to do all of it with one life bar. But I think the game is balanced around the fact that Richter can't, um... The fact that Richter can't use potions. Yeah. Look how freaking fast he is, though. Like, goddamn. Like, you just feel so damn powerful. You just go through the castle at, like, lightning speed. I won't lie, guys, it is actually really tempting to do a frickin' playthrough, an entire playthrough with just Richter. Just because of how fun this is. Like, he absolutely shreds these enemies. Oh, and also, uh, everything drops hearts now, so you get way more hearts instead of money. Dude, this is so fun. Oh yeah, I can't get the, I can't get the meat now. This is like you know what this reminds me of actually? Kinda reminds me a bit of um like meta nightmare mode. That's kinda what this reminds me of. It's interesting that he calls on Rondo of Blood Maria. I don't know why, but I was expecting um I was expecting the Symphony of the Night Maria, but you know that's that's too basic. <laughs> I mean this game was short enough, but if I'm doing it with Richter, it's gonna be even quicker. Oh yeah, those freaking amazing enemies. Cool. Is Rector voiced by um his uh Dracula X um voice actor in this game? Honestly, I can't tell. 
Dead ass, there's dead ass nothing in here. So yeah, since you're not like since you're not searching for for shit, you just um you just gotta go from point A to point B. Bro, bro, the Rector's so fucking powerful because he starts with the best weapon in the game. Oh, and he can, he can, he can dash. He can dash just like the other characters. Oh yeah, the 3D eyes. It's weird that those are like the only 3D enemies in this game. And imagine if this was just the base game, running around super fast, and like murdering everything. This is what it feels like to play as Alucard in the beginning of, of Symphony. Oh, I'm level 7 now. <laughs> Maria falls so far behind because, uh, she's like not that fast. Actually, in theory, couldn't you? S you could switch to Murray if you want, right? Yeah, you could. And she has her own like weapons and stuff. No voice lines, though. Sadly. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep playing Richter mode. Honestly, I'm gonna play for like another hour and see how far I can get. And I might make this, like, some bonus episodes or something. So, I'll be right back, actually. I gotta go piss. Yeah, let's keep, uh... Let's keep going with Richter mode. Honestly, I mean, to be honest, it, I could very well end up... Because this could very well just end up being, like, um... My Virgil thing in Devil May Cry 4, where I played him for, like, an hour. And I said, like, yeah, I'll continue this, and then I never did. <laughs> Don't be surprised if that happens, okay? This is just a little for fun thing to hold me over at the end of the, uh, series. But, I mean, since this just- since this is so fun, I'm gonna keep going. <laughs> Cool. Like he comes with he comes with everything. It's basically a new game plus playthrough. Wait, 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 we're already at the next save point. And obviously I'm not gonna try and hundred percent. I'm not gonna try and hundred percent this. The bosses are gonna be like the real star of the show here. Never mind, <laughs> the boss is dead. I mean, what is even the what? What are you? What is the goal even of Richter mode? Oh, he can also slide under that? That's fucking hilarious. Ooh, ooh. You just go so damn fast in this mode. Oh, 
I mean, I feel pretty, I pretty feel, I feel pretty invincible as Richter, honestly. I don't know, is the goal just to, like, complete every area or something? Maybe, I don't know. Well, what are we gonna do about the team up mechanics? Are you telling me Richter's just gonna have, like, some super inhuman strength? All right, there's nothing over here. Yeah, I think we need to go down here. Um... I'm gonna assume we're done here? Yeah, I mean, like, what's the point of Richter mode? Are you just trying to get to Dracula as fast as possible or something? I'm not sure. <laughs> so I guess, uh... We'll try and make progress. Oh, that's just a save point. There we have this room again. I think this is the only way to go right now. Apparently you're- apparently I was supposed to get some sort of dash ability in, um... In, uh, the main game. But, I don't think I got anything quite like that. There was no dash ability. Cool! <laughs> If I'm not mistaken, I believe this is a dead end. Yep, this is a dead end. Just go wherever, basically just go that wherever the hell you want. That's that's the rule of Richter mode. Oh yeah, and the kick can also the kick can also do shit. Unfortunately, you can't like see your level. I think that's the only downside. <laughs> it's freaking noises. Oh, we got a teleporter now. God damn. I mean, I know Maria is OP, but geez. Invisible man, gone man, more like it.
I don't think there's anything over in that corner. Mudman! Oh, there's nothing in here. Well, I'm like half dead, so now I'm actually kind of in need of a uh, heal. Where is the nearest heal anyway? I don't know, but there's a, uh... We can just go here now. Welcome. Yeah, here. The maids are back. Oh, another, another war, but no save. I think the saves are, like, nearby. There's a save, like, right over here, I think. Never mind. Is it, what, is there less save than Richter mode or something? Or am I just stupid? I haven't found any. I think I'm just dumb and I haven't found it yet. Also... You can't check your percentage either, I don't think. Yeah, you can't. I mean, you can sure as hell check what area you're in. Yeah, I leveled up, let's go. You only need one weapon anyways. <laughs> oh, boss time. Ooh. Oh, here's a save right here. Alright, can we beat this boss at level 10? Let's find out. Probably. Oh, he does a lot of damage. This guy took a long time in the vanilla run, so... <laughs> yeah, just keep attacking. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I love that I can do that. Wait, did that, did that being that boss level me up? I think it did. Pretty dope, huh? So I'm not mistaken, I believe over here is the desert world. Yeah, I know down here is... that's where it is. Frickin' gun lady things. Cool! Well, unfortunately for you, I don't have a dress. So you can't vacuum me to death. Damn, another level up for free. In theory, I could just go I could just go to like the final area right now and get it level up quickly. 
Which, you know, that could be funny. I'm not dealing with these mummies, bro. I'll let Maria deal with those guys. <laughs> Just completely skipped all those guys. Oh yeah, right. I keep forgetting. I was supposed to be able to come up here. I don't know if I ever did. Also, in theory, I could just skip to the end of this dungeon already. Just go up here. Skip straight to the boss. Those skeletons ain't worth fighting, man. Warp room. We got a dead pharaoh on our hands. <laughs> what do we have up here? A dead enemy is what we have. Oh yeah, we can open this up. I forget where the boss is at. So what are their crossbow arrows here? Or crossbow armors? Probably aren't there any crossbow armors in this dungeon. Actually, no. I'm thinking of the the guys from later. Oh, here's the boss. Oh wow, she actually hits pretty hard. Okay, okay. Uh, that boss actually hits pretty fucking hard if you don't dodge. Oops, I selected the wrong file. Shit. Not what I meant to do. Yeah. Uh, let's try that again. Okay, we can't be completely reckless. Actually, wait a minute, I'm not doing any damage to her. Maria's doing all the damage. Go, Maria, do, do, do the damage. You got this, Maria. Oh, shit. Oh, there we go. Maria did it. She killed. She killed the birds. Or, <laughs> well, she killed her with the birds. Okay. <laughs> wow, I was expecting Maria to carry that fight, but hey, I mean, she carried a lot of this so far. Do 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 do. To be fair, I am kind of going a little bit of out of order. Also, I'm level 14 now. Yeah, these guys are gone. <laughs> Bro, I can just be absolutely... I can just be an absolute dick with a whip. Oh shit, I'm out of magic. Oh, I'm cursed. Well, that's not good. 
All right, well, I think I'm done here. I don't like the desert level anyway. I'm leaving. I beat the boss. I, I can't. I, I did what I came here to do. Yeah, at least not the poison worm. The poison worm is really annoying. <laughs> Look at me go. Alright, I beat the desert world. I'm good. Oh yeah, there's a warp there. Obviously, Rector mode is like... It's for, like, true gamers, you know? People who want more out of Port Could Have Ruined. Alright, so nothing else in here, I don't think. Whoa. Damn, that guy just fell like a rock. Oh yeah, right, there's nothing in here. Hey, there's another level up. Good. Cool. Look at all these funny enemies. Also, I'm losing my health. Nah, I'm not dealing with that. Damn, the skeletons are rough. Look at me all being almost dead now. I think there's a safe point. Oh, that's a warp. Ain't there a safe point in one of these? Or maybe not. Well, I guess we gotta go back to the other the other save. There sure as hell are a lot more warps than I remember. To be honest, I was planning to go um, shopping after this. But now it might be a little late, because now, um, everybody's gonna be, like, going there for lunchtime and shit. But that's not good. Alright. Well, let's actually go, um... Let's go a different way this time. Ooh! I never went right. Oh, there's a free save there. Free save that I missed out on. Yeah, it's kind of my problem is this place doesn't really have any like it just kind of exists. Hey, I mean, at least I'm level 15. I don't know, what was, what was I when I ended the game? Like, level 30 or something? Something like that. <laughs> I, love just, I love just randomly running into a freaking enemy and taking 7 damage. Keep the pace going.
Maria can do most of the heavy lifting while I'm just trying to get from point A to point B. Oh, there's nothing over here. A lot of nothing here, huh? Frickin' made, bro. I can kill the maze in one hit now, at least. Sakia wish, um... <laughs> Actually, you know, Sakia's a better maid than these chicks. Who am I talking about? I love that Maria just throws doves at everybody. Like, screw those guys. Oh god. Frickin' Pitbull, man. Wait, hey, hang on. Max MP up still exists. Oh, that's HP. Even better! I needed that, actually. Wait, so HP and MP up still exist, then. That's good to know. I'm pretty sure more of those exist in the later game. Cool. Yeah, I'll come back to that room later. We need to go back there with a later switch anyway, don't we? Yeah, here. Oh, great. There was nothing over here. Just a dead end. Yeah, if only Richter could run this fast in, um, you know, the actual Rondo of Blood. It'd be a pretty peak game then. Then again, I haven't played Rondo of Blood, but I heard it's good. Especially if I play the one with all the funny anime cutscenes. Cause yeah, who would have guessed? Rondo of Blood having anime cutscenes. Yeah, just more hearts. It's not like I'm missing anything over here, am I? Missing, there's a door. Yeah, Vampire Killer just vanquishes all evil. He's not saying filthy cow anymore. <laughs> I guess I guess she I guess she overcome her uh, hatred towards cows or something. Yeah, good on the list for not for not disliking cows anymore. Sure, let's open up this shortcut. Ooh. Actually, I'm, I'm doing okay on health. I got like half my health still. There. We unlocked that path. Where should I go? Should I go up or should I go left? Well, we know if I go left, I'll loop back around to the main castle, so maybe we can go that way. Yeah, let's go this way. Freaking larvae everywhere. Don't want to get hit too much. There's like nothing in here. <laughs> yeah, this is a dead room. Even more dead than in the main game.
Well, I know if we keep heading this way, we can get back to the... the main place. Nothing in here again. I don't think dashing actually makes you go any faster. And I really need to get back to the save point. Thank god the save point is down here. Or not, I know it's up here. Well, by this point, these guys are really weak. Actually, that does make me wonder if there's anything good in the starting area. Hmm, when should I stop? Should I stop in, like, 15 minutes, maybe? Yeah, I might. Stop at, like, 12.30 p.m. my time. So I tell you what, we can do one more episode of this where we try to beat Richter mode. And if I don't, if I get too, like, frustrated at it, then whatever, we can just stop. So there's nothing up here. This is just all dead-end crap. But I will, I will explore it just to say I've been here. There. Now it's marked off for good. I mean, I've, I've, I've almost completed the entire castle at this point. Like, look at this shit. I'm only level 16, I've done like half the castle already. <laughs> like, it's actually insane. I did, I did, um... I did, in like, one hour, what it took me, like, six hours to do normally. It took me six hours to beat all this castle, but now here I am, I've basically beaten most of it. In like an hour. That's the power of Richter mode. Bro, what the fuck? There's nothing in here. What's the point of this room? Another dead end, just to deceive me. <laughs> Ooh, ooh. <laughs> yeah, the the the, well, the place where this play, this game truly shines in Richter mode are the bosses, because the bosses are actually like bona fide Castlevania bosses, where you have like well, like four hits to beat the boss, and if you get hit four like four or five times, you just die. I mean, it makes, actually, I mean, it makes sense that they don't give you health, healing items because you're so broken. Like, you're so frickin' strong in this mode that you don't need healing. If you need healing, then you'll skill issue. Oh, I kind of do need to heal again. <laughs> I should make up a uh, shopping list soon. The only thing I know is I want to get, um... Probably more hash browns. <laughs> well, it is a mode after already playing the game. Yes, thanks for playing that out, chat member. I don't know, like, if for some reason, I just expect Richter mode to be, like, ball-bustingly like, difficult, but this isn't... This is the, the opposite. This is piss easy. But it's also fun, just being, like, actually OP. <laughs> It really is like, you know, Meta Knight mode. Where you just like absolutely destroy everybody. Oh, yeah, we can do we can do one of these paintings. How we do this painting and then we'll call it a day, and then I'll do the rest of I'll do the rest of Rector mode next time. Because Rector mode is going by pretty quickly. I mean, this is coming from me who did not play the Richter mode, or, or the bonus modes in any of the other games. 
<laughs> it's different for Rector mode. See, I was see, I was thinking it was gonna be like that. Well, actually, yeah, I never played that. It. <laughs> Yeah, see, I, I had a feeling I wasn't crazy. The Rector mode in Symphony of the Night is harder. But then again, Symphony of the Night is an easy-ass game. <laughs> so, I guess I gotta put the difficulty in somewhere, right? So that's kind of ironic. So, this game has it backwards. The Rector mode in this game is easier than the main game. And the Richter mode in Symphony is harder than the main game. <laughs> they had, they got it all backwards. Oh yeah, right. I gotta be uh, careful here. Oh yeah, fuck you, Fleeman. Oops. Oh. HP Max. I haven't found an MP Max yet. I don't know if those exist yet, or if I just haven't found any. Well, if I'm not mistaken, I need to go on I need to go on the top route so I can get to the Legion. If I remember my playthrough, yeah, yeah. Well actually I don't remember. I'll find I'll find a way in there. Ooh. Oh yeah, right. I, for, I forget praying. Maria has sub weapons, and I haven't been using them. Well, now we need our MP back up. What's over here? More larva. Well, now we need to find a save point somewhere. Well, I don't really need a save point that badly, but I am getting pretty close to dying. So I'm like half dead. And in Richter mode, if you're half dead, you're basically almost dead. <laughs> That's the way I see it anyway. And you don't want to be half dead. Or almost dead. I got to be in the clown zone again. Those armor knights are surprisingly tough. Whoa. Well, it's more my bad for not paying attention to the patterns. <laughs> oh yeah, can Richter get in there? I don't know if he can. It's not like there's any point. There's not really any reason for him to go in there anyway. There's no nun outfits or anything that you can sell and screw up the entire quest line. Oh yeah, we, we want to go down here. I don't. I really. I don't. Really, I never really like. I never really liked this area, anyways. So I'm just gonna try and get to the boss. Okay, warp and the save point. They made this more like a fun mode. Good, because the main game was already fun, but this is even more fun. So Richter is Proto Man in Symphony of the Night. Gotcha. Well, I don't think the Legion will be a joke in this mode.
<laughs> well, and also not to mention the uh, button inputs in this mode are easier. There we go. <laughs> Boom. Let's just get rid of the shield for fun. Dang. Okay. It's a good thing they let wreck their infinite jump. I'm almost dead, actually. This is bad. <laughs> Come on, Maria. Shoot, shoot the birds. Well, I'm cooked. <laughs> yeah, because you can't heal, so you actually do need to be a bit careful. Okay, I'll do this Legion fight. Bro, I keep fucking selecting the wrong save file. God, why does it default to the first save file? That's fucking stupid. <laughs> Like, why can't it just, you know, default to whatever save file you're playing last? Like a normal, you know, like a normal game. <laughs> if anything, I should probably switch to, like, the axe or something. The axe might be more useful for this boss. But the laser can just come out of nowhere and say, fuck you. I could just do this. Cool. If anything, I think it'd probably be a bad idea to get rid of all- get rid of the shield. I think you have to deal with more lasers. Oh, never mind. I got rid of the, the shield at some point anyways. Cool. Got him. There we go. See, I did that pretty well, and I still took, like... Still lost, like, 60% of my health. Alright. Well, let's save, and... Yeah, I think that's good. I think I might... I might actually finish Rector mode. I don't know. I'm kind of... I'm kind of tempted to now. <laughs> but... If I'm, you know, not busy with any games next week then yeah i probably will boot this up one more time and we'll see if we can finish uh richter mode because this is pretty fun so yeah anyways i'm still enjoying portrait of ruin so as always guys make sure to like and subscribe to youtube and twitch and um it's game night tonight so we're probably gonna play something i hope we're either going to play Mario Party, or we're going to play Jackbox. I don't know yet. I'll, I'll see um, who's free. And, you know, who wants to actually do shit. So, yeah. Anyways, uh, I guess I'll go do my shopping. So, I'll see you guys later. So, see you then.